I'm going to show you how to do it. So first you'll need to crack, you have to weigh the eggs and you have to crack the eggs. You want to give it a little help? Yep. Oh. oh, there's a shell. So we use the shell to get the shell out. Alright, it's the easiest way of doing it. Okay? Now we need to crack the other egg. Okay. That weighs ten six. One hundred and six. What is the same amount of the eggs? So, example, with the butter and sugar, we have a hundred and six. So we will need to weigh the the butter, we need to have the butter 106 and the sugar 106. Brilliant. So we our eggs first, and then whatever our eggs weigh, the rest of our ingredients we need to be the same amount. amount. So, what are the other ingredients that we need to use? Butter, sugar, and, and flour. flour. That's right. <laughs> right, let's take some big scoops. Oh, we're getting close. Look, we've got it to 98. No, I need to get to 99. 106. 106. There you go, we Exact, exact. 104! 104! 105! 106! 104! See how tiny a gram is? It's only that much. Right? Next, Next comes sugar. sugar. Now, normally we'd use caster sugar, but there's no more left. There's none left because of lockdown. So, we are now using. Granulated sugar. We, sugar. We, we make a lot of things in this house. Okay, so I tell you what, let's get a new spoon, otherwise, we're going to end up with butter inside the <laughs> sugar, and that won't be good. That won't be good. Even though the sugar is really mixed up with the butter. <laughs> we don't want to mix them here, do we? Right, ready? Watch the thing now. Can you put some in for me? What, when is it said now? So, what's 17. that? 17. 55 100 so we only need a little bit now we don't want to go over to it 103 Four. 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 Yeah. <laughs> Jessica, we need to put this in Mix. our mixer. Alright, so let's just get this ball off and put it in our mixer over here. Right. I, like, I like to let the spoon up to this. <laughs> <laughs> Can you turn it on? So just let that mix up a little bit. We have to go, it has to go really slow first, then you move it up. It'll get louder when, when you move it up in the next step. You're going to waste that mixing. Mm -hmm. Where's that mixing? You're going to mix up the eggs. We want to get them all mixed up. So it 
to make the proper flour for us. So what's that that we need to mix in? We need baking powder. Good girl. So we take that off there. If it won't, we want the, the flour working to rise because on brownies we don't want it to rise. That's right. We're making cakes. We're making cakes today. So we are now going to, what are we going to do now? We're going to weigh the flour. Flour, that's right. Can you remember what the measurement was? 104. That's right. How many more grams do we need? We need three more. No, try again. <gasps> Two more. That's right. <laughs> 104. Oh, five. Oh, oh, oh. We need to take one of the tiny, tiny grams out. There you go. 104. <laughs> okay, so I just need to now add in two teaspoons of baking powder. So if I show you how I do it, right? In. Whoa, that's cool. And make sure you get it all in. So this is a half a teaspoon. So to make one whole, we need two of these. Right? There's one whole teaspoon. I need another whole teaspoon. So how many more of them do I need? Two more. Two more, good girl. Ready? In it goes. There you go. Marvellous. Right, next thing, what do we need to do with that? We need, we put, no, we need a whisk it. We need to mix it again, yeah. The eggs. And we'll add the eggs when, when we mix it, mix it. So we'll start off slow and we'll make our way up, okay? Two, four. Yeah. Otherwise, what happens? Do you know what happens? It'll go cray cray. It'll go cray cray. It'll go everywhere. Wait, what? Where? Yeah, the flower goes everywhere. It's crazy. Oh my gosh. We don't want to have that cooking accident. <laughs> my little sister, we don't, we don't only cook with our little sister, but we can from the kitchen. She <laughs> from the kitchen. <laughs> She's watching Charlie's crack. Kitchen. She's watching Charlie's Crafty Kitchen while we're doing Jessie's Crafty Kitchen. <laughs> okay, let's turn it up to four. Oh, it's going to be fast now. I think we need to knock that down. Oh, too Because I just got some on my chin. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm do I don't like eggs. Oh! Go on everywhere! Don't worry about that. Right, I know I'm going to pour it in. Now it's, it's getting all wet. That's right. Good girl. I think you can crank it up to four now, Jessie. Here we go!
Brilliant. Twelve. Jesse, what's one less than twelve? One less than twelve is eleven. Good girl. What's eleven less than eleven? Take away eleven. Zero. That's good. <laughs> We're getting there. <laughs> so let's turn this off now. It always starts in that stops in that position. But there's this bit button on the top where it can park. So it, it'll probably park there. Yeah, so now you'll be able to press that down and lift the arm. You might not be able to, it's a bit stiff. <laughs> Here you go. Yeah, that looks like plenty to me. Now you put it in. Ah, my hands. Lovely. What are they going to look like eventually then? They're going to look like that. So what do we need to use? We need to use some sprinkles, white chocolate buttons, brown chocolate buttons, and, and some, some eyes. Some eyes and some melted chocolate, chocolate as well. So we've decorated the cake with the melted chocolate. We've done one as an example and we're going to make up the rest now.